Adele Bryce uh, was a peasant woman who came here with her family. She was in her mid to mid twenties when this apparition happened, but she came here with her family from Belgium and uh, from uh, the southern part of Belgium, Walloon, Wallonia. Uh, she was an um, uneducated woman, and she had had an, an accident with lye, uh, probably making soap or something, and so one side of her face was scarred, and she couldn't see out of one eye. Uh, but she was someone who was very dedicated to her family. As a young girl, she had made a promise to the Blessed Mother with her friends in Belgium that she would someday go to a convent of teaching sisters. That never happened because her parents asked her if she would come and help them in this new land, this new country, to set up a homestead and to begin to make a new life. Adele checked with her pastor there in Belgium and asked him what he thought, and he thought it was more important that she be obedient to her parents rather than join an order at that time. So she came with them and they settled not too far from this place in Champion, Wisconsin, and they were with all these other uh, people that had come. There's a big migration from Belgium at that time, and it was very hard. Life was very, very hard here. It was a wild country, uh, very hard to make a living, etc., because nothing, the soil wasn't cultivated. There were no farms here at that time. They had to tear down some of the forested, forested land in order to make a farm. And so Adele was right in that situation. In fact, just like so many other apparitions, she was on her way to do a common household chore of taking grain to the flour mill, to the grist mill, and uh, that's when the Blessed Mother first appeared to her. So she was someone who was very docile. To, she had a strong prayer life, but she didn't know a whole lot about the faith either. She wasn't really properly instructed. So she was kind of embarrassed in a way that the Blessed Mother would ask her to do this, to go out and teach the children in this wild land. She was kind of embarrassed because she didn't feel confident she had a good enough command of the church's teaching. And Mary told her, do what I ask, do not fear, I will be with you, I will help you. And that's how Our Lady got the name, Our Lady of Good Help. When she appeared to Adele, she asked her, who are you and what do you want? And she identified herself, I am the Queen of Heaven. So she appeared in a beautiful form here, right in this area, just a few feet away from me. And she said, I am the Queen of Heaven. And then she gave Adele her mission. And Adele said yes, not just on that one day. She said yes every day for the rest of her life for many, many years. And she grew a teaching ministry. She cared for the handicapped children. There's a school here that she oversaw the building of, and they had an orphanage at one time. So she served that mission in various, various different ways over the years because she wanted to be obedient to what the Blessed Mother asked her.